Well, hello, I'm Victoria, Victoria Rose. And in case you're wondering what's been going on in my life lately. These are lives. What, what are they? Chickens? From our own chickens. They must always say 38 degrees on there, which is 38. Well, lift it up so I can see what they look like. Celsius, not Fahrenheit. They're, they haven't been warmed yet, right? No, they've just been put in. So what kind of chickens are these? Most of the marums. There's the green egg layers. And then there's this pointy white. We think um, it's the brown chicken outside. And this always has to be, don't open this without permission. That always has to be down in here. It turns them, pulls them back and forth. Good morning, Victoria Rose here. <laughs> and I'm gonna show you a day in my life living in a shed in Pennsylvania in the country, quarantined, isolated. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed already unsubscribe later if you don't like it you know you can subscribe now before you realize you will like it and then it'll inflate my ego a little bit before you unsubscribe because i need that right now <laughs> as you guys know i am now in pennsylvania i travel a lot and right now during the virus that's impossible um the closest big city to me is pittsburgh the first thing that we do when we get up well actually the first thing that happens is my mom comes in she's like I gotta keep a distance i'm like mom you don't need to come in here if you're trying to keep a distance from me and she like tries to get something from in here or she throws a cookie at me or <laughs> she gives me something that i really didn't need i got showered so i'm just gonna put on some makeup i know it's not really necessary since we're quarantining and all and i don't see anybody but it makes me feel better about posting on social media and you know i have to go see my goat so Let's go and do the makeup. It's kind of a small space and I don't really have um, a lot in here, which I don't really care. I'm trying to keep it simple anyways. Oh, I got these at the Amish store. They're like energy, I don't know, they have caffeine in them, so I'm gonna have one. Oh, 25 cents. <laughs> yeah. I forgot to add in like when I first wake up, I spend like an hour on my phone. My only con, it's so my only like outlet into the outside world. I've been, I've been here for a couple of weeks now. I'm gonna do this. Okay, good enough. <clears throat> Makeup, done. Now that we have mediocre makeup on, I'm gonna show you a tour of my shed. So you walk in, this is my bed, this is the heat, this is my small, tiny little weights, which I, I really want to get heavier weights for working out, but I also have my resistance bands and my restricted blood flow, restricted, restricted blood flow bands, which um, you can work out lighter weight and still get good results with them. So I'm going to show you guys a workout today probably with those. And my mom has all of her stuff up here. My mom does eBay and she sells things. So this is gonna be her like eBay room. I have internet and heat and electricity out here. Uh, it's very kind of her to let me stay in here. There's a light up there. And then this is a window. My mom put some flowers in here for I me. used to try and learn the guitar. The thing with me is I'll learn something to a very um, average level and then I'll not be able to get past it anymore and that's just all I'm gonna ever know. I have this window which I have a cup that I need to take into and then I have some BCAs in here. That's my view of the forest back there. This is the desk that my stepdad made me in like two hours and then I stained it. And the stain 
matches the the mirror and uh, windowsill and stuff. So and then I got this chair and this other chair. Oh, <laughs> forgot to mention something, guys. I'm a mom now. <laughs> I'm incubating some eggs right now. I'm just like being a mom out here in my shed. <laughs> She's hatching an army of chickens. <laughs> I don't know why. She hatches them for eggs and then she can also sell some chickens if she chooses to. They've been in there for like a week now so they have like two two to three more weeks and then we're gonna have babies. So you guys stay tuned for that. This is real excited stuff. Also my mom brought this in here and it's starting to smell so good. I don't remember what it's called. She would disown me for not remembering still a hy hyacinth? Hyacinth? Mm. Kind of smells like lavender. Comment below. That's a hyacinth, right? Don't let my mom know that I don't know that still. Oh. <laughs> Why, thank you. <laughs> she smuggled me in some coffee. <laughs> you wonder why I'm strange? I get it from my mother, but my mom's gold, so maybe I am too. I deserve better. I deserve better treatment from these boys out here. I think my mom deserves good, and maybe I'm like my mom. So maybe I deserve good. She's gonna watch this video. She watches all my videos now. And then sometimes I'll be like, so did you like that video? She'll be like, I don't think people are really interested in that. I, I wasn't really interested in it. I'm like, my mom has no filter sometimes. So she'll just say things. And I'll be like, mom, that's really offensive. You know I'm really sensitive about that. And she'll be like, that's not how I meant it. I'm like, you know that's a trigger for me. This is my desk. I had this book ordered to here and I'm finally getting it now and able to read it. And then this is my journal that I still have from Montreal. And it's getting pretty full. A lot of um, a lot of dark feelings in there that I was journaling while I was going through the darkest point of everything. And then my vitamins, this hair, skin, and nails. I have this adrenal formula. I feel like my adrenal glands get really exhausted. I have to have naps like every day. It's really weird. I feel like a baby. 5-HTP is good for um, mood. So. And then I just got some woman's multivitamins and my BCAs. And my mom also brought this lamp in here. She thought it was so cool. And then I just have my, um, uh, computer, what do you call it? What, that thing that I edit on. Down here, I just have some snacks. Dark chocolate cherry, uh, probiotic $1, 12 grams of plant protein. I got my babies, my vitamins, my mirror, my desk, guitar, my bed. Oh, and then that corner is just like all my, um, my suitcase and my clothes. It's, it's cute, right? If it's too cold out, I'll work out in here too. And uh, I'll show you guys that, but I think I'm going to be working out outside today. I probably get ready to either work out. Um, sometimes I'll feed the goat in the morning. I didn't today, my mom does. I also kind of want to clean out its shed. I don't know if I'm going to get to that or not. It might be part of my workout. We have a lot of activities planned for today. I know. I know. <laughs> it's so exciting. You know, this virus is, is creating a weird reality out here. <laughs> So I'm gonna do a workout now. I need to put on some sunblock because there is some sun. Hey, 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 right here. Do you see me? Stop, stop playing music, Alexa. All right, I'm gonna put on some sunblock and then we're gonna go out and do a workout because he wanted to, don't eat those plants. He wanted to um, come outside, so. Don't nibble on my fingers. You little nibbler. I think the people who had him before tried to take his horns off, but like for some reason they didn't work, so his horns kind of messed up. You can't come in here. Well, <laughs> goat's gonna do what a goat wants to do. Go, go back outside. I just, I just need to um, get my stuff. We're gonna use these resistance bands and we're gonna try and find things heavy to lift. I'm just gonna do um, a little bit of a leg workout outside and maybe finish it on the inside. Watch, he loves this. Go ahead. Yeah, <laughs> da, 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 da. He's like, give me food now. <laughs> That's his favorite thing. Yep. Good boy. Good boy. Excellent. We're going to use some resistance bands and I'm going
going to I'm gonna try and lift him. So with these you put them on um, the muscle that you want to restrict the blood flow to, which um, helps get you a pump. Yes. If you want to know more about it, then just like look up resistance, um, restricted, I mean, restricted blood flow bands, and you can find all the information there. But I'm just going to use these today. you guys enjoyed the tour of my shed and a little bit into my day I'm gonna do a part two of a day in my life because this one was getting a bit too long so stay tuned for the next video which will come out soon and stay extraterrestrial I love you guys very much okay bye